I love welcoming you guys here to the brewery and to uh, learn a bit, a little, little bit about science. The Philadelphia Science Festival just rolled through town and Yards Brewing Company hosted From Hops to Stein, The Science of Beer, a full-on tour that walked the public through the scientific processes that make our beloved brews. So the Philadelphia Science Festival is a two-week celebration of science, engineering, math, and technology. Um, we're here to bring science to the public and um, engage them in a way that they haven't been before. So today, we are, we've, we've actually made an effort to showcase the fact that science is in everything that we as Philadelphians love. So today we're talking about the science of beer because Philadelphians love their craft beer. It's structured to give people a tour around the different stations and different processes during beer from the grain becoming mash, from the mash then going into a kettle for the boil and then what happens during the boil and the chemical reactions that happen then and then off to the fermenter where uh, the yeast converts all the sugars that were given by the grain uh, into alcohol and which makes tasty beers like this ESA that I'm, I'm drinking right now. The event began in the yard's tasting room with a half hour meet and greet, after which attendees were treated to a full on tour of the brewery that focused on each specific scientific process that takes place while brewing. Yards went a step further and brewed a very special one shot science festival beer. So we have a couple of people here speaking here tonight. We have. Um, we have all uh, a number of brewers from Yards. They made a special beer called E equals MC Beer. We had a whole citywide vote. Um, over 1,500 people voted, and um, they decided on this very clever name. Uh, this beer is called E equals MC Beer. Uh, we brewed it specifically for the Franklin Institute. We decided to take um, our Thomas Jefferson Ale, which is a uh, strong American ale. We fermented it with Belgian yeast, so it gave it a Nice Belgian character, a little bit of fruitiness to it, a little bit of sweetness to it. Uh, we also used a Japanese dry hop uh, called Sirachi. So at the end of the beer, it has this really nice uh, bit hoppy, bitter flavor to it. We also have some representatives from Monell, which is the Chemical Sensory Center, um, doing a presentation and a tasting um, to get people to think a little bit more about how their taste buds work and why and how beer affects your taste buds. Drink Philly would like to thank the folks at Yards and the Philadelphia Science Festival for a great time. We'd also like to thank the beer and science. Delicious science. It was really informative. You know, I'm a small time home brewer and I came here to just check out what's going on at Yards and I, don't know, I learned a lot. The whole science behind it was pretty incredible. I like it. It's a science. science.